Mr. Nowak, you understand? NASA astronaut Lisa Nowak was prepared to pay a $15,000 bond on charges of attempted kidnapping and head back to her home in Houston. Shortly before the astronaut was about to be released from our custody, we satisfied the bail conditions and the bail amount. Um, an OPD officer showed up to file a new charging affidavit charging with attempted first-degree murder. Nowak will be staying behind bars. It's the latest twist in a bizarre love triangle featuring high-profile NASA astronauts and an engineer. Orlando police say the 43-year-old mother of three and Navy captain drove 900 miles from Houston to Orlando wearing a diaper so she wouldn't have to stop to confront a woman she believed was vying for the attention of another astronaut, Navy Commander William Opheline. Our primary concern is uh, Lisa's health and well-being. Um, make sure that she's safe, make sure we get her through this and we get her back to a safe place with her family. This is a private, it's a personal matter, it's a legal matter that uh, she and her family have to deal with. Officers allege that Nowak put on a wig and was armed with a BB gun when she followed Colleen Shipman, a NASA engineer, onto an airport shuttle and to her parked car. They say Nowak asked Shipman for a ride and then sprayed something into the car when she rolled down the window. An officer said he followed Nowak and saw her throw away a bag with the BB gun, knife, rubber tubing, and a steel mallet. Nowak was originally charged with attempted kidnapping, attempted vehicle burglary with battery, and destruction of evidence and battery. The Florida judge was going to release her with a GPS device to track her movements, but that was before the attempted murder charge. Nowak and the 41-year-old Opheline both flew NASA missions last year for the first time. They trained together but never flew together. She reportedly told police their relationship was more than a working relationship but less than romantic. The police report said Nowak told officers she only wanted to scare Shipman into talking about her relationship with Opheline. Ed Donahue, the Associated Press.